Gentlemen, it's live here. I um, just want to give my quick look or um, digital review of Linux Mint 13 Cinnamon. Um, this is using the Cinnamon desktop um, as its environment. Um, first of all, I'm just going to go to the menu. We're going to scroll through here just so you can see what's in here real quickly. Sign the video. Cheese does not come by default, and neither does Kazam Screencast or I placed it there. Okay. Um, in this in this desktop environment, there's something called Cinnamon Settings. You can find that on the Preferences and go to Cinnamon Settings. Cinnamon Settings basically lets you um, customize or um, control your panel, calendar, hot corner, themes, effects, applets, extensions, desktop, windows, and fonts. Now, you're probably wondering what hot corner is. Hot corner is this. When I move my mouse to the left top of my desktop, it does this. This right here will allow me uh, would allow me to switch between my desktops. Also, add a desktop if I please, and also delete that desktop if I don't want it anymore. So now I'm just gonna go back here. Um, inside themes, you get a whole bunch of themes you can choose from. These themes are very nice. Um, the one I was using at first did not come by default, so you know I just choose the one that I like the best. Um, now we're gonna go to appearance, and we're gonna go to and I'm just gonna show you the um the new wallpapers that come by default which are very nice looking um, I'm really excited about these new wallpapers because in the previous versions they only released wallpapers that had either the Linux Mint logo or either they were very leafy and green uh, sometimes they released something that was brown but it usually had to do something with rocks that was kind of relating to leaves or some sort so they have these new wallpapers and they're very awesome to have um, very nice looking very cool very just just great the resolution of these images are very high and they do look great. Um, the terminal, as you all know, for those Linux for those Linux Mint users, um, in previous versions you would get a quote inside the terminal with this um, animal looking thing that was made out of text. That is now gone. I'm pretty sure there's a way to enable that um, in this version right here, but it is gone. Um, you know, a lot of stuff has changed. Um, the menu looks different than previous because of the new environment, um, and it's great all together. If you use this OS and you have anything you want to tell me about it, um, if you have any questions that I may answer, comment um, below. Also, subscribe to my channel for more videos, and also thumb up this video. See you later.